some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in somewhere in Ohio where a sovereign citizen has just been pulled over and arrested, not only for the usual sovereign citizen stuff such as no plates, no license, no insurance, but she also has a warrant out for arrest. And stick around uh, for the later in the video when she uh, gives us her justification for being a sovereign citizen. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I have a shoulder uh, thing. So please don't yes. grab on my shoulder like that because my shoulder is, okay. it will get low. Okay. Hold on, Mom, CJ. Yeah. Let me lock my door. Okay, hold on. What's the problem with you? Just grabbing on me like that. I'll pull it, see? Okay. Look, can I lock these so I don't turn up on you? Um, give me my fucking phone! Oh, hell no. I have to call my mother. Oh yeah, I'm sure your mother will be all too thrilled that you are in jail right now because of, uh, well, your sovereign citizen activities, which these activities and beliefs really don't get you too far in life. I mean, saying that you are above the law and... Uh, not using a driver's license or plates or anything like that. Yeah, it's a good way for you to, uh, well, end up with a bunch of traffic tickets and some jail time. So, yeah, a real winning strategy to life right there, my friend. Good work. Okay. Let's come on. Never, no. never got a plate for the car either, right? No, and I'm not, I, it's not never registered. Got a license. Okay. It's not registered. You're not driving, you're traveling, same I'm thing traveling. as last time. I'm traveling, yes, you know that. Okay. Oh yeah, he's heard these arguments before, and he probably knows they're a load of BS, which is why he pulled her over again, because they are BS, because they get their definitions from uh, grossly out-of-date uh, copies of Black's Law's Dictionary. Yeah, that, that'll that help you out in court. You know that. <laughs> You can't have stuff in the back seat, okay? This is mine. Okay. I'm not going anywhere with it. You just can't have it on you. Simple as that. Okay? So I can't have my debit card either? Yes, no, I can get everything for you. You just can't have it in the back seat. Why can't I have my keys? Because you can't have anything in the Okay, but I don't want you touching my keys. That's fine, but you can't have it. Okay, but I need to call my mom so she can come pick me up. Well, you're not getting picked up. You're in jail. Okay, but I can still get out. Yeah. Okay, so I need her to come pick me up. Okay, and we can make that arrangement when it gets there, okay? What off Ma'am, you need to relax, okay? No, you need to get the fuck off me. Okay. You know goddamn well I ain't in your jurisdiction. You just want to fuck with me. Jurisdiction. What jurisdiction do we have? I'm not in your jurisdiction. Are you in the city of Rio? You're not even supposed to be fucking touching me. You're in the city of Rio. Well, Judge Lanto tried that jurisdiction argument here with a judge recently, and, uh, well, it backfired stupendously on him because the judge is actually educated on that kind of thing, as well as these cops, you bloody softard. What's up? Okay. 1603. 1606 radio. 06. I have one detained. Um, she's in war with us. She's just sovereign citizen. Yeah, a total moron. Sovereign citizen. Driving around with no insurance or anything like that. Boy, it is just a nightmare to think that these idiots are driving on the roads with no insurance. I mean, what happens if they get in a car accident? Oh, wait. Uh, Tank when X uh, already uh, addressed that. He pretty much said that he'll... Uh, Give $10,000 to a fellow uh, sovereign citizen, but he won't do jack squat for anybody who's not. So, yeah, the rest of us are pretty much screwed. A little longer than a few minutes later. Her mom's on her way to the car. 
It doesn't have plates. It's got a private license plate. What's this car? Yeah, it has no license plate. I know it does. That's what I told it. Oh. This is the ticket I gave her before. I don't understand how she has... She's sovereign, but she has enough of Ohio ID to get a medical marijuana card. The medical marijuana. Yeah, officer, you just don't understand. Uh, sovereign citizens want uh, all the benefits and none of the responsibilities of being a U.S. citizen. So, yeah, uh, basically, she wants to be able to get the medical marijuana card and is willing to go through the processes of doing that. But in order to have the responsibility of a driver's license and an insurance and a tag, no, she's not going to do that. She's going to uh, skirt those responsibilities and make other people suffer for it. You can't talk to those people. They, yeah. just, they just drag you into a circle of fucking. Yeah. Like, I, I don't know what you're talking about. Well, like, I'm not a sovereign citizen. Said that you just said you were. I'm sovereign. Okay. <laughs> when she's able to use our currency as the United States, you know, she's got cash, she's got, you know, so it's cars, just so. a all oh, ring of insanity. So. She, she tried pulling away from me when I popped yeah. out. Because as soon as I got behind her, she came running over here. She's using the United States mail system. To yeah. Mail yeah. On, you know, driving on our public so road. I'm going to be nice. I'm going to go mail that for her. Okay. And then uh, I'm going to write her for obstructing, resisting, and a bunch of traffic. Take her to Northern Wilson. Yeah. Actually, I might just go off my last ticket that I wrote. I'm just copy and paste the code. Non-compliance times three and fictitious. I want to get a wallet and a purse. Yeah. I get to hear one say, all the case laws are told me, but I'm a sovereign citizen. Got to all the well, she did last time. Okay, so obviously the officers know how to deal with sovereign citizens. But let's go ahead and listen in to this sovereign citizen's mentality and get a better insight into uh, what they're all about. So let's roll that beautiful bean footage. I have a right to be who I am. I have a right to... Yes, yes. Listen, I don't care about your opinion. Your opinion's old. How about that? Yeah, that's the crux of her a whole argument. She thinks that people are telling her what to be, how to think, and everything like that. Just like a typical, uh, well, let's just say, conspiracy theory nut job. Yeah, uh, she's fallen so far that down that rabbit hole, she's become a full conspiracy theory nut. Nobody is telling you how to live, how to work, how to breathe, or anything like that. You are simply being uh, taken in because you are operating a motor vehicle on the public roadways without the proper paperwork in, in order. Because, you know... The Tenth Amendment lets the states create laws that are not covered in the Constitution, and therefore states have created laws that will govern their own roads. And, uh, well, guess what? Pretty much all 50 of them, you have to have license, insurance, and tags. Because it is all part of responsible Driving. Sixteen forty radio. Sixteen forty. Where is that animal playing out? It was on Edgewood and West. It was a brown and white dog running loose. And you're not God. You can't tell me what to do and you can't tell nobody else what to do. 
Y'all put on them uniforms and it makes you feel like you got a position of power, like you can treat people like shit. But that's not the case. Because as soon as you walked up to me, you were rude. You didn't come up to me and say, hey, ma'am, you know, what's going on today? You came up to me on some bullshit because you thought you had in your mind that I was a certain kind of person or a certain kind of way off top. But you don't know me. I'm not a person. I'm a person. Suspended license. I'm not hurting you. I'm not committing no crimes. I didn't steal nothing from nobody. I didn't run nobody over. I didn't. I'm not dealing no drugs. Okay, I got a warrant. It's for a traffic ticket. Traffic warrant. When did I hurt anybody? Oh, no victim, no crime. Okay. Well, you do realize that since you are uh, driving a vehicle on a public roadway system, that you have certain responsibilities that you have to adhere to in order to do that. That mainly having insurance, a driver's license, and plate. That way you can, uh, well, be responsible for whenever something happens while you're on the road just as you mentioned before you haven't run over anybody but what if you have what if you injure that person and you didn't have any insurance to cover the issues if the person managed to survive so you would be at fault for their uh, medical bills rather than the insurance company you would be held responsible so, it is a prevention issue, you dumbass. Well, at any rate, guys, that's the gist of her argument right there. Completely ignorant, completely stupid. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.